So what do you do when you have three vehicles, the Honda Beat, the Ihatsu Mira and my Honda Accord outside? Get another one of course, an e-bike. Here's three things I didn't know about the bike to work scheme in Ireland. Number one. There is a maximum amount that you can claim for, which is up to 1500 euro for an e-bike. But it doesn't mean that you can spend the maximum of 1500 euro. You can spend more than that. You can spend two grand if you want, claim the 1500 euro and pay the 500 euro extra yourself. So that 1500 euro is gonna come out of your wages, out of your gross wage for 12 months. The company will pay it up front and it'll get the bike straight away. That's what happened with this bike. It was around two grand with all the accessories and I ended up paying a little bit myself on top of that 1500 euro maximum bike to work scheme. Number two, you don't actually have to be cycling to work five days a week to be able to claim the bike to work scheme. You can be a hybrid worker or you can be 100% remote. You're still eligible for the bike to work scheme. Number three, you don't have to buy from an Irish shop. This is the one that surprised me the most. I've been interested in these rad power bikes for years, but the one thing that always held me back was they don't sell them in shops in Ireland. It seemed like a waste as I couldn't claim it on the bike to work scheme, which is up to 52% of the cost of it. I contacted rad power bikes and I asked them about this and they said they've sold a lot of bikes to people in Ireland. And the way they do it is you request a particular bike and the accessories and everything that you want they create a pro forma invoice and they will send that or you could send that to your company and they will be able to pay the invoice. It does not have to be an Irish company. Rad Power Bikes are a US company with a base in the Netherlands and it was all easy peasy. So for anyone thinking about using the Bike to Work scheme, I would highly recommend it. It's been really seamless. It'll come out of my wage for 12 months so I won't notice as much as a big cost up front. Hopefully I'll get some use out of this Rad Power, Rad Runner Plus. So why did I pick the Rad Runner Plus? It's basically a utility bike. I want to start doing more kind of short trips rather than using the car and the engine doesn't even get a chance to warm up. Uh, use this instead, go shopping at it. That's why I basically got these two baskets. This one here is very, very straightforward, fits onto the front. This large basket can actually be fitted in two orientations. You can put it lengthwise or widthwise. I didn't really want to put it widthwise just because I thought it might be a bit more difficult to manage uh, when there's actually weight in the back. Um, but when I tried to fit it lengthwise, although it does fit on there, it's butted right against the seat. This seat is a bit of a weak point on the Rad Runners. Um, it's very short and a weird kind of a shape, so um, I would probably end up replacing it. I just thought I would use it for a while first. Um, but when you put this rack right up to the back here, you have a tendency to sit on it and, and put your arse kind of hanging over the, the, the end of it, which then ends up kind of encroaching on that, so it, mean it means you have to sit more forward on it. So it wasn't comfortable at all. Um, so I put this on sideways for a moment and see how it goes. I literally haven't taken this out on a cycle yet, I just assembled it. So really looking forward to it.
Great crack. Love it. Slant. 